right. Hey guys, how's it going? Well, I, I have a kind of a special treat here for for myself. <laughs> I'm sorry you can't you be here to taste this. But I'm gonna put that right there. <clears throat> this is all the way from Switzerland. Yes, the food and the beer. Okay. And um you know, I, I don't want it to get cold, but um, this is from Anthony from Switzerland, and he sent me um, he sent me some smoked sausage. Now this came all the way from Switzerland, but it's cured meat, and it's best before date. It's great. It does not have to be refrigerated, so it's made it here, and it smells awesome. These are lentils with bacon, and I don't know what else is in there because I can't read. French or Swiss or whatever other language is on here on the can that he sent. So those are that. And what we've also got here is these are these are like what we would call um, hash browns. These are potatoes, shredded potatoes. You fry them into a pancake and it's like a hash brown. That's what we call them here in America. So he sent these these things to me and he sent me the instructions how to cook them and um, and because they were all in, in other languages, I couldn't read it. And it, I'm telling you, the house smells absolutely incredible. A meal from Switzerland. I feel like I'm, I'm in Switzerland right now eating some of their food. And he sent me a stout that he made. Now, this was bottled from a keg, so um, it may not be as carbonated as it needs to be. But um, I'm going to give this a try first, and then we'll crack into this and see what we've got. Okay, I followed his instructions exactly. Wow, that is great. It's nice and sweet. There's a great mouthfeel. It doesn't look like there's a lot of head on it, but I explained that a minute ago. But it's carbonated enough for a stout. And it's got a great chocolatey sort of um, mocha taste to it. Um, a nice thick mouthfeel. And I'm hoping it's going to go good with this meal he sent me here all the way from halfway around the world. Isn't that amazing? It's the first time. Oh, that's a good beer. Okay. All right, let's go in. Let's do uh let's do some of these smoked sausages. Here we go. Mm. <laughs> oh, that's good. Firm, firm texture. It breaks apart, but it's very smoked. It had a string on it. They also obviously hung it in a smokehouse. Oh my god. Pardon me, but I self indulge. <laughs> Okay. Mmm. Cheers. Mmm. You know what? I've been asked by uh, several people to do food and beer pairing videos. Well, I'm not a professional on that subject, but this goes together so well because you've got salty and you've got sweet. They complement each other. This is awesome. I'm very happy. Nobody's home tonight. I've got the place to myself. I thought I'd come down here into my my brew dungeon and have a little dinner here on my in front of my my um, computer and whatnot, rather than a big old kitchen all by myself. These are the lentils with the bacon in them. Mmm. Lentils are awesome. You guys should incorporate them into things. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Anthony. We're going to go for the uh, potato thing now. This is really neat. I don't know. I, I just something about having a meal sent to you all the way from halfway around the world. 
this has all been preserved. This, this food is, you know, this was packaged, this potato thing. There's no worries about me getting sick or anything like that. That tastes exactly like hash browns. The sausage was boiled, not boiled, was heated in hot water for an hour to get all the juices flowing. The lentils were just gently heated in a pan and this was fried in a non-stick frying pan. And uh, that's how we did it. So I'm gonna sit here and enjoy this. I wanna thank Anthony, very, very kind of him to send this all the way from there. And um, there's, there's more sausage left upstairs. I'm sure my family will definitely enjoy that as well. Cheers, guys. 17, and this is really special to me. I really appreciate this. So cheers. Thank you for watching. Oh, and I've got chocolate, Swiss chocolate for dessert as well, which I haven't got with me right here, but it's, it's there, and uh, that's what's for dessert after this, so. He sent me that as well, because yeah, I love chocolate. I, I'm a sucker for chocolate, especially good chocolate. Thank you guys for watching. Cheers. Good food, good beer, good times. Be safe. 17.